The shortage of paramedics lingering on in Louisiana and across the country and healthcare workers still feeling the impacts and recruiters are trying to do all they can to get more people how hired. Brian Coward with Acadian is joining us this morning to tell us more about it. Thank you so much for being here this morning, Brian. And of course, you all are adding more classes to try to get uh, people hired. Tell us about it. Yeah, absolutely. So thank you for having us. Um, like we talked about, there is a shortage, not just locally, but regionally and nationally. And Acadian, our subdivision, which is our training academy, has offered to uh, provide, we're doing six EMT classes a year to help with the training and offer people a career path moving forward into the EMS field. And some of those classes you all are uh, gonna pay people while they attend classes. Yeah, so we have uh, one division or one of our classes that we're gonna put on is for our EMR trainee classes. It's a 10 day program. We will offer them to uh, go to class where Acadian will pay for the class and we pay them to go to class and at the end of the program they would have a certain return of service to work for us for a certain amount of time. Now what about that person who's interested in uh, they wanting a career change or they may be wanting to become an EMT but do they need a lot of medical background or what? No, they don't. Um, what they have to do remember with this field is, you know, we are dealing with, you know, medical and the people that really do well are people that want to give back, help the community and just have that sense of just drive to want to go out and offer some assistance to people that they've really never met and be able to grow within a company and within a career and we can do that at Acadian for them. And then I know you mentioned that, you know, the class, uh, the EMR class is like 10 days. Yes. But then so look, after that 10 days, what's next? Yeah, so if they go through the EMR class after the 10 days, uh, they'll complete the class. They'll have to get certified through the state of Louisiana. And then there'd be some additional training with us just, you know, on the ambulance. And then they would start working for us. They would have a full-time commitment to work for our company. And then from there, what we want to offer those individuals is to get into our EMT class. We want to offer them a career path. So they're EMR, but if they're an employee of ours, they can go through our EMT training, and at that point, we can help reimburse them or pay for that class. And for how much is it that you all are paying people for these classes to actually sign up? Yeah, so um, for the EMR trainee class, if someone comes to that program, when you get paid uh, $11 an hour to go to the program, we pay, Acadian pays for the program. At the end of the program, they become certified. Their pay will go to $13.50 an hour, but now they can work full time and really work as much as they'd like to. And once they're hired, are the hours typically flexible or how does that work? Yeah, so with our, just with EMS, we work shift work, just like the fire and police. So we have hours that are days, nights, some days and nights, but mainly 12 hour shifts. So it's days, nights, weekends, you know, someone is here all the time, they have to prepare for that. And where can people go get information and what's like the deadline to sign up? Because I know one class starts uh, Monday. Yes, sir. So um, if you're interested in the EMT class, that'll start next Monday the 17th, the deadline would be tomorrow. So they can go to becomeamedic.com and get all the information there. And if someone is interested in going through our EMR trainee program, what they would do is they would go to acadian.com, find careers, find ambulance careers, and then look up EMR trainee for their local area, and that'll give them the information they need. Okay. And that class, the next EMR trainee class will start May 